Morgan Uber here with first year head coach Paco Labrador, who also brings Navy its first ever Patriot Lake trophy in volleyball. Paco, how did your team do it today and fight through the resiliency? This is a team that's been in this situation a few times. They've been in they've been in the postseason tournaments. They lost in the first round three years ago, and then they lost in the final two years ago. And so now, I mean, I think they've just been generally building themselves up to this point. So the team was very ready today to win it all. You knew you were the underdogs. You told me that that underdog mentality could pay off. How did you see it pay off after set four coming in to set five, losing an emotional set like that with nine lead changes and 20 tie scores? Yeah, I mean, I knew that that set four, um, we were just trying to take it little by little, the five point little runs. And, you know, we had we had a couple swings for, for championship. And so I'm, I'm really the most proud of them to be able to say, you know, we didn't get it on that particular set, but it really, uh, they stayed so focused in that fifth set and kept doing what we needed to do to win. And I'm, I'm proud of it. Towards the end, uh, I think our serving really, really made a difference. Earlier this week, you told me that sophomore outside hitter Maddie Scatoni had the ability to put the ball away when you needed it most. Yeah. How many times did she oh. do that today for you guys? Yeah, we're going to get her some sort of bionic arm. I mean, she had 22 kills, and I mean, I think she was only halfway through the second set, and she was already up to 44 swings. So uh, we rely on her heavily, but she's she's a workhorse. She's, she's willing to carry us. And even down the stretch there, a couple of those swings in the fifth set were huge. Coach, congratulations. Navy now headed for the first time to the NCAA tournament.